Good morning, everybody. It's Deb. Um, I know I said the last haul I filmed was my final haul of February, but that was not truthful. It was truthful at the time. However, I had to go to the post office today, and so I thought, you know, I've been seeing these videos of the Dollar Tree having my favorite, favorite, favorite stickers. So I'm going to go check out my Dollar Tree, which isn't that far from my post office. So I did, and that one did not have them, but I did buy some things. I tried to be good, but I did get a few things there, and I'm going to show you that. Um, but this is a double Dollar Tree haul video, because I ended up at a different Dollar Tree later, um, which I, I didn't even realize was, was where it was. I was heading to a different one <laughs> and stopped to... Um, grab a bite to eat at a fast food place, bad me, didn't need to do that, but I did, and, um, anyway, in that same shopping center was a Dollar Tree, and I didn't, if I, if I knew it was there, I'd for completely forgotten, because I don't frequent that particular shopping center, there's not many stores or restaurants or anything in it that I like to go to. So, and it's kind of tucked back in a corner where you wouldn't normally drive to unless you knew it was there. So, I went there. And more to follow. And I also, oh, in between, I stopped at Target to check out their dollar spot. Um, I got some things there, but not a whole lot. I'll, I'll show you. Um, just didn't care for a lot of it this time. So, which was a good thing. Because I actually spent more at the two Dollar Trees than I did at the Target, which is pretty funny, I think. Anyway, let me get started with Dollar, oops, dollar Tree number one. Um, first I'll show you, I got more ribbons. I don't know why, but I am loving this raffia ribbon. You know, it's like a paper ribbon. Um, they call it raffia ribbon. And I know I have this color, but I use it a lot, so I got another one of those. And then I got sort of a denim -y blue color and a bright yellow, which I thought is nice for spring. Um, I don't remember getting the yellow, and if I did, shame on me. And then I just got this one, it's called Satin Ribbon, and it's like a, I might have already gotten this before too, sort of a champagne color. So anyway, um, I really don't need more ribbon. What I really would like is lace. I guess I should have wished for that on one of the wishing sites because I don't have lace and um, what are those things called? Appliques. Lace appliques. And I really would like to get more of those. Anyway, then, you know, Christy had gifted me a bunch of these little tea lights and I probably have a tea light candle holder somewhere, but I got these nice heavy ones from Dollar Tree. They're, they're solid, and um, they, I thought, would be good, especially with the new kitty in the house, so that they don't get knocked over easily. <laughs> so, then up in the front of the store, they have um, these, you know, spring things, and I do love, you know, they had one with a butterfly, but I actually liked these flowers with the butterflies on them better, so I got them, and then I got these treat bags because I thought I might try to make, what do they call those, a loaded envelope? Don't you make those with a bag? So I thought maybe I'd try to use one of these for, um, to make one of those because you get, oops, ten pieces. So I figure if I mess up, um, I can try again and it won't cost me a whole lot. <laughs> So that's that. Um, then I got four bubble mailers. And um, they come two to a pack. Oops. My only beef with this is they're two to a pack, whether you get the eight and a half by eleven or the smaller ones that are six by nine, but I don't always need an eight and a half by eleven, so I got some of the smaller ones anyway. Okay, then going down the aisle that has the tablets and the stickers and stuff, I got this little notebook for me because um, I'm wanting to keep better track of the challenges and things I'm entering. 
Um, I, I need to do better with my plan error stuff and um, or actually instead of keeping track of the challenges just the I don't know I'm still thinking about it the names and addresses of people that I'm corresponding with and whatnot exchanging with on YouTube and Facebook um, I'm still thinking about that because I'm doing an IC challenge I may just keep all those names and addresses in my index card file which I have a little box already um, which is why I wanted to three by fives but um, I'm, I'm finding I have to write down all these challenges and what's required and so forth in something and I thought maybe a nice little notebook would be a way to do it and this is pink which goes with my background paper I do like pink it was the only one they had in pink the other ones were brown and black so I got that and it has 80 ruled sheets, which, guys, I cannot write without lines because I write sideways, you know, diagonal up the page and stuff. Um, I don't know what it is about me, but that's just how I am. Then I got two of these. I hadn't seen. They have two other designs also in the white with gold foil. The long tablets. They're 60 sheets lined. Um... So, yeah, one will go in my to-be-eventually-given-away pile, and the other one's for me. <laughs> just do that right now. One in the giveaway pile. Okay, and then I had seen somebody haul this linen cardstock pearl finish. Um, Twelve pieces for a dollar, which doesn't seem like a great buy to me, but I don't have any of that kind of cardstock. I have white and I have colors, but I don't have any linen, and I do like that look, so I thought I'd give that a try. Um, they're five by seven, so I don't know. I don't know seem it's too big to make a card, but if you fold it in half, it would seems like it'd be it would be a very small card. <laughs> but we'll try it. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. And then I did get some stickers, even though they didn't have my ones I was looking for, which I'm not going to tell you what they were until the end, uh, until I get to the, the other Dollar Tree. Okay, so then they had these, um, which I bought before, but I do like them, and I do use these uh, sticker gem things, and these have, like, glitter in them. I don't know if you can... Sorry about the glare. Maybe if I hold them this way. There we go. I sort of see it a little there. And then these I had never seen before, and I thought those were kind of cool tie-dye heart stickers. And you get 112 of them, so those I liked. And I don't know why, but I was sort of drawn to these fruits with happy faces on them. <laughs> so you got um, pears and oranges and grapes and lemons and apples, so those were cute. And you get 120. And then I just got one each of these. I do have these oily flowers, but I didn't have these two sheets as far as I know. So I got those. And then the last crafty thing I got in the store were these two twine rolls that were down in the children's crafts, but I hadn't seen the... In fact, this was kind of hidden, the lilac pink and blue. And then I got the orange... Um, just like a mint green and a yellow. So I thought that was a good selection. Usually when I go, all they have is the red, red, orange, and purple or something is the color. I forget. Or blue, orange, and purple. I forget. Anyway, I, I haven't liked them, so I haven't gotten them in the past. But I like these for Easter and these for spring and, and Easter, too. So that is my Dollar Tree number one haul. Um, okay, so then, oh, and I did get, like, a pair of socks and stuff for me, because, I don't know, for some reason this year, I've thrown away about four pair of socks because they've gotten big holes in them, not just even little holes, like my toes are totally popping through. So, anyway, I got this for my mom because she's homebound and, um, lives alone, which is a little scary to me at this point, but um, she does word searches, so I'm constantly buying her new word search books, and I'm at a point where I don't remember 
which ones I bought her and which ones I didn't. And I don't think she remembers at this point either, so I just get whatever one looks good and for her. Excuse me, I had to take a sip of my coffee because it's 5 o'clock in the morning and I've been up since 3, maybe a little earlier than that when my son gets home from second shift work. I actually cooked dinner in the middle of the night this night, which I don't usually do, but anyway, I did. Okay, so then back to sticker. I got, guys, I got like 20 packs of stickers. <laughs> yeah, call me crazy. But I am not buying for a while. And then I say that, and, and what pops into my email, but Joanne's having 60% off all paper products today. And um, so this is, uh, what is today? Tuesday. And Michael sent me a 50% off coupon in the mail, and oh, it's got to stop. Anyway, I got purple, little flower ones, and orange, which is not my favorite, but I have some orange paper I had picked up from um, Tuesday morning, a little while back, and I thought I could do something with that for summer. And pink and orange go good together. Like my bedroom from the 70s, don't you think? They go good together? Yeah. And some people would probably like purple and orange together. Actually, that doesn't look bad there, but it's never been one of my favorite combinations. So anyway, I got two of the pink, because that's just how I roll. And then I um, yesterday mailed one of these off in this color to, to someone who needed some flatback pearl so they had another one and I got one more and that was the only color they had in fact it might have been the only sheet of them they had so I got that okay these rang up some of these rang up as handmade stickers some of them rang up just as stickers they're all well they're not all job brand maybe that's why some are John and some are not <laughs> anyway this one I hadn't gotten before it says hopes and dreams where this glare is really bad. Um, and lots of butterflies and pretty florals. And this one I do have, but I love it. And I've used some of them, so I wanted another. There we go. This one I don't think I have. With uh, I like windows and doors and things, guys. And it also has a, a bench, which I love. And a bicycle with flowers in the basket. And a stairway. And a gaz um, what do they call those? Not a gazebo, but it's like an archway. Oh shoot, I can't think of it. And a fence with like rain boots hanging on it. That's pretty cool and just a big flower pot. So I thought that was pretty. I only got one of those. These I got two of. Um, fun, good times, lots of hanging flower baskets and other flowers. And I thought that was really pretty. And it's 3, 3D. And you can be able to see it. You can sort of see it there. But anyway, they are 3D. <coughs> Excuse me. And then I got this one that says spring, which I could have used the other day. <laughs> but I'll be doing more spring projects. Anyway, um, wish and lots of prettiness there. Birdhouse. I love birds and birdhouses. I have two blue bird houses and I have a big um, squirrel poof bird feeder, which I have to fill today or, or tomorrow. I guess later today when I get home from my mother's. Um, and I can see because it's dark, so. Okay, I got this one, which I didn't have before. I love that pink flower. I love the purple flower with the button. I, uh, that's just a picture of a button. It's got birds and butterflies. I got two of those. And I got two of these. Smile. That one says, life is good. Yes, it is. Could be worse, you know. Um, fresh air. Have to be thankful for what we have and realize that there are a lot of people that. Oh, I got three of those. Wow. 
must have been the only three they had. I don't know. And I do have this one. Oh, as I was saying, yeah, just be thankful for what we have and realize there's a lot of people worse off. And, um, anyway. So, yeah, I like that one. I've used, I keep using this and this and this and that. But I haven't used these bigger pieces yet because they're too big for pocket letters. Okay, now the name of this video is... I found them! I found them! Guess what I found? Can you guess? Can you guess? Ah, oh, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you. These are my all-time favorite, 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 favorite butterfly stickers. And I even, in the first Dollar Tree, I asked the clerk at the checkout, I said, you know, I came in here looking for one specific thing, and you don't have it. And I'm pretty sure they're coming in. And he said, well, they get shipments on Wednesdays, which I now know. Um, but I found them at the other Dollar Tree, and I was like, I, I must have been really excited because I said it out loud. I'm like, oh, they have them! And some lady came walking by and just smiled at me. Um, I think she might have been wanting to look at them, too. <laughs> But the package was a little bent, and I'm like, oh, man. I'm like, I bet that's the last pack. But it wasn't. They had three of the blue ones. I was so excited, guys. I love these. And I only had, like, two of the butterflies left, if that, because I used them. I want to share, you know. But they had them also, which I hadn't seen before, in this red. And I got two of those. And then they had them in this um, yellows and oranges and browns kind of colors. Sorry, I don't want to take them out of the packaging. Anyway, I was so, 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 so excited. Had to get them because they don't have them very often. And these ones, the blue ones, I just love. Love, love, love. And what tipped me off was Kimbo's Creations called them and said, guess what guys, they're back in, and she had the blue ones, I'm like, oh no, I have to go to Dollar Tree, and I did, and my mine, of course, didn't have them, which I sort of thought would be the case, um, and there are three Dollar Trees now near me, I thought there were only two, and I never went to the third one because I didn't have to, I found these at my second one, and it's actually closer, a little bit closer than the other one, so yay, yay. Anyway, um, I think that was pretty much it. I got two other little things, but I'm not going to show them because one is for a giveaway and one is candy. Ugh, i got to stop buying candy. I didn't buy too much. I only got one little pack of candy. And on the other one, yeah, there were some scrubby sponges and pretzels. I didn't want to bore you with that stuff. And the pretzels are for my son's um, lunches. So then I'm going to just combine everything. I have a Target haul. One sec. I didn't get a whole lot at Target. But I did get a few things. Um... Did you hear that? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, this is what you're hearing now. I got two of these cute little buckets because I think I want to do something different with my pens. And if that doesn't work, I'll give one of each of these to my my grandgirls. That one's actually hot pink. It's showing red, but it's pink. And the other one's like turquoisey blue green with Easter eggs so I thought those were really really cute and then somebody had shown this tulip washi tape so yeah I got two of them and I got me some erasers because the erasers on my mechanical pencils never work <laughs> they always gum stuff up and I thought I had erasers around here but you know after many years, they get kind of old. And this had been hauled by somebody, and I couldn't find it before. But I found it now. Pink lace uh, 
paper tape, die cut paper tape is called. I got two of them. Okay, then somebody had tucked these into the back of the things that were hanging up and they're gold foiled bunny rabbits. Aren't they adorable? I love them. I got two of them. <laughs> Gotta get two. Those were the only two that they had. So I got them. And then I got a bunch of tags, which I swore off tags, but I've been using some of them, so I just thought these were adorable for spring. The tulips goes with the washi tape. Yeah, 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 see? Washi tulips, yeah. Mm. Okay, and then I had seen these hauled and thought I had to try them. Vellum tags. I don't know how they'd be for writing on them. I liked these florals with the foil and the blue. These I only got one pack of two because they're not punch tags, but I thought those would be nice for um, what you call it, writing notes on the back for happy mail or whatever. I don't know. Or just embellishments. I like this blue with the ha Hello Spring on it. Different blue and green. You don't usually see that for spring. Um, oh, wait. Okay, I got one of these. It's calendar sticky notes. I saw somebody using that and it looked like a good idea. I think it was Home with Tanya. Tanya. I'm not sure. I'll have to rewatch her videos and see. Um, that's another one of those. I had bought two of, two of those. Uh, let's see. I got these little butterfly erasers. The only pack they had. Thought they were adorable. And I have stationery. They had one more of the big tablets, but I got two of these take notes. They're like, um, I think I've heard people call them mouse, yeah, memo mouse pads. There it says it. Um, I'm always forever, I have so many tablets, but I don't have any that I can also use as a mouse pad and lay it, or lay it here on my desk nice and flat. And I love this design, so yeah, I got two of them. And then I went back to the Easter department, and I got these tiny jelly bird eggs. Now, these Brock's ones were five in a pack for five little boxes for a dollar, and right next to them were the jelly bellies, which were a dollar for each little box. And I really wanted them at first, and I thought, I can't justify that price difference. Anyway. Then I had to get these. These were not on sale. And these were near where the cards were. But, um, look at these little bunnies with their little tails. Stickers. They're puppy stickers. You only you get 24, and they were $3, which was bad. But I just couldn't resist the little bunnies with the tails. And I, somebody else hauled something similar, but not quite the same with the bunny tails. I can't remember who or where they got it. And then, um, on their, in their stationary area, they had a clearance rack. I don't know if it was a good deal, but I got two of these five by, I don't know what size they are. They're one inch binders, but these I think will fit my things that I bought to put my stamps and, um, die cuts in. So I got two this size. And then I got one of the um, the bigger ones which was on clearance for $1.72. And it's actually an eight piece bundle. It's a one and a half inch binder. And it comes with these um, I think three tabs and also there's a, a pocket. I'll show you try to show you pocket with the snap. So I, oh, sorry. So I thought that was a good deal for a dollar seventy two. Call an eight piece bundle. And then lastly I got this is the only color they had, but um this it's a one subject college rule notebook with I don't know how many sheets. But anyway it was a dollar forty is what that says. It's not focusing. 
regular $2.99, it's a dollar off or something, but, um, so it's just a regular notebook, and it's all recycled, 60 to 70 percent recycled, green.com. Anyway, yeah, that's my target, and two Dollar Tree hauls. Hope you enjoyed it. I had fun. I was bad. And now this is the last day of February. And this is my last haul of February. And hopefully I can keep myself out of Michael's and Joanne's today. And this next coming month. Because I don't really need anything else. Except lace and lace appliques. So that's all. Talk to you later. Happy end of February, everybody, and um, here's the new beginnings in March. Bye. Hugs.